so we made it to Cape Town and here's a rough story of how that happened. Yay! We're here! However, we can't check in. Surprisingly pleasant chili con carne, free bottle of wine. So guys, how, how are we feeling about being in uh, Ethiopia? <laughs> Hungry, tired, yeah. <laughs> it's going well so far. So we've successfully passed through immigration into Ethiopia. Well, five out of the six of us have. Yay. We finally made it to the hotel in Addis and uh, it's pretty darn swish. And uh, just had our complimentary breakfast. And about an hour or so we're um, going for a tour of the city. was discovered in 1974 by an American archaeologist called Dr. Jonathan Johnson. So, in local language, Lucy also called Dinkanesh, which means you are wonderful, you are beautiful. The oldest stone tools in the world. It's called Ashuri, the to defend and to dig the... He's our great great grandpappy. <laughs> when suddenly, tortoise. He's after you. <laughs> just so peaceful, isn't it? Yeah. Chuckle. Yeah. 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 That is insane for three quid, right? Which is called February 12 Monument. One of the memories of the great Muntaka against Italy and Ethiopia. First line of the trip. Who made a friend? <laughs> That's uh, Addis Ababa by me, capital of Ethiopia, meaning a new flower. My uh, rather delightful Ethiopian scarf. I'll buy the beans. I must admit, I was expecting you to spit it out. I'm kind of disappointed you didn't. So, I mean. So, it's not. <laughs> Could have just stayed in Wales. After that, we went back to the hotel and got some more grub and then to the airport for possibly the worst flight I've ever had in my life. Probably should have filmed some of it, but uh, I really was not in the right place for that. It was far too much travelling, far too uncomfortably. But we made it. 